Outside, the snow is falling down, and every child is having so much fun. The snowman is twice the size as me with a smile as quirky as mine. We have a busy day today. I'm gonna try and get through too much. It's currently 20 to 2. I have been working all morning. I need to do more work, I need to edit more, but I also need to clean the house. I thought I'd do it in a way of like I edit a video, I clean for a bit, I edit a video, I clean for a bit. Ideally, <laughs> This is the setup I'd have all day, but we actually have a concert to go to tonight. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I don't really wanna go. We've tried to sell the tickets, no one's biting. We got these tickets at the beginning of the year, it's for Shag Married Annoyed, which if you don't listen to podcast, it is Chris and Rosie Ramsey's podcast. And basically I've just stopped listening to the podcast as much over the last few months because it's just very complainy. Don't get me wrong, some of it's still funny, but it just got very, very child orientated, which just, isn't my vibe and very very complaining about their children <laughs> and about each other and like I say I do still find it a bit, bit funny but I just I'm not like I want to go see their concert their gig their whatever live show and we've had the tickets up for sale this week but nobody's bought them they've been up on the resale on Ticketmaster and I've put that on my story on my Facebook and just nobody's buying them and I don't want to waste the tickets Jack's very much been like well we'll just not go and I'm like no we paid like 80 quid for these tickets I'm not wasting 80 quid. So ideally, we wouldn't be going to that and I could do this all day, but we have to go to this live show tonight. <laughs> so like I said, I've been working this morning. I've just fin finished editing a vlog. Vlogmas is intense and I let myself get behind because if you are new, I have been ill for three weeks. I was ill at the beginning of Vlogmas for two weeks. I had about five days off and then I got smack bang hit with it again, full on cold. Today is two days after we got back from the Cotswolds. In the drive home for Christmas video, I was talking about how unwell I felt. The next day, complete write off, was not, I wasn't very well. But today I'm feeling a bit better. It's getting there. Apparently it's really common with this cold that's going around. There's like a resurgence, like you feel better and then it just comes back. So apparently I just got what everybody else had. I'm fine with going to the gig with being unwell because like I said, I'm on week three, so I don't think I'm contagious anymore. I'm just still not feeling great. But because of that, the house is a mess because I've st we've still got everything from the Cotswolds, like the bags and stuff that we brought back, and also the house is just a mess. And what we need to clean because on Sunday we're having friends over for like a Christmas night and we want it looking cute. Jack is away at his work Christmas party, <laughs> a Christmas meal, so I don't have his help today but I'm gonna try and get done as much as I can, but I do need to edit because I, I've just finished editing today's video, I need to do tomorrow's video, and I need to do Sunday's video. So I think I'm gonna set a timer for an hour, then ugh, I need to have lunch as well, if that's the thing. I think maybe if I focus on cleaning the living room, then have lunch, then edit for an hour, then clean again, that might be a good structure. This is how we are looking in the living room. So it's not like horrific, but it's just bits and pieces. This whole bag's full, so I need to like empty the bag. Nick, you need to get rid of all my cold stuff. I mean, not get rid of, because I'm still not great. And then the rest is, it's okay. It just needs a bit of a tidy. So I'm thinking this should be the quickest room to do. I also want to like proper clean, like spray everything down clean because like I say, not been well and people are coming over. So I think if we tidy first, then see how I feel, have lunch maybe, but we'll just figure out as we go, shall we? So let's get started. Sleigh bells ringing, diamonds blinging, carols singing, favorite season. Chosen, snow is falling, Elfie's calling. Check my list twice, most of y'all done. Sleigh bells ringing, diamonds blinging, carol singing, favorite season. Sleigh bells ringing, diamonds blinging, carol singing, favorite season. They say, say, Nick, what you got up in that bag? Yeah, I got racks, racks in my sack, hurt my back. Yeah, they said, say, Nick, what you got up 
in that bag, yeah. I got racks, racks in my sack, or my bag, yeah. I'm back yeah, to I working. I'm just about to start editing the Cotswolds vlog. I had lunch, but right i'm gonna put no no it doesn't need a trigger warning it's just an emetophobia thing so i don't know if any of my emetophobia people can understand but i ate something that i was like after i ate it i was like oh my god that's that's old enough to be off so i had a bite of the bagel with cream cheese that i think was off and i was like crap checked it it was off so I remade the food, I threw out the old food, which was such a waste, but never mind, I don't want to be ill. But now I'm just like, I panic so much about being ill. <laughs> and now I'm like, what if the salmon was off? Even though the salmon was unopened, <laughs> so it'll be fine. But now I'm just panicking, so I'm glad I'm not moving about. I'm going to sit and edit for a while. Once it's been over like an hour or two, I'll be fine, because I'll know that I'm, I'm okay. But I'm just panicking, and I hate, I hate metaphobia. <laughs> anyway gonna get on with editing this i'm not sure if i'm gonna get it done within an hour it's 10 to 3 now i might edit up until 4 and see where i am and then go back to cleaning It's now five o'clock, not ill, thank God. <laughs> Obviously it is a bit later than what I said I wanted it to be, but it got to four and I was really like nearly done. So I finished everything apart from the thumbnail. Jack has rang and asked what we're doing and I was like, I don't know, we haven't sold the tickets, but I think we both don't want to go. And then my mama's just text asking if we're going because she's gonna have Oakley if we do go. But we've just both decided we're gonna wait until he gets home, which should be in like 10 minutes, to figure out what we wanna do. Because I think really we both don't wanna go, but it's a lot of money to waste. And I'm sure it would be like a good night if we went. Like I'm sure we'd enjoy it. It's not about that. It's just the fact that I just can't be bothered to get into Newcastle, figure out parking, get into the arena and then wait for it to start and I just can't be bothered for all of that like stuff with it like I really because I haven't been well and because I'm a bit behind on work I think I'd really just rather a night in it's just not great timing for a tour I think if it had been any other month I'd be going but we're gonna figure out when he gets home I need to do the thumbnail but the thumbnail takes more time so I'm gonna start tidying again I think I'm gonna do the bottom of the stairs because there's just loads of stuff everywhere like I said Jack's due home in like 10 minutes so I'm gonna do I'm gonna start moving stuff so we can sort it the kitchen needs done I don't want to do that without Jack though because I struggle with the kitchen so I'm just gonna start the bottom of the stairs I when I finished editing earlier I went out there to fill my water up and ho oh, ho, it was freezing. I've got the fire on in here, like the, the electric fire. So it's a bit warmer in here, but I went out there and I was like, oh my God, it's cold. So I put the heat on to warm it up out there so I could go out there and tidy. I'm hoping it's gonna be okay out there now, but we're gonna go do the bottom of the stairs. So let's go. <laughs> to get home now and then see what we're gonna do <laughs> it is the next day so we did end up going we couldn't decide for ages but it was the type of thing that i really didn't want to lose the money so i said to jack i was like when i was like let's just act as if we're going like like let's go drop oakley off drive towards town and then if we're not feeling it let's just go do the tesco shop for our friends coming but then if we feel like it we can go in and then it just kept getting like that i was like when we got close we were like well let's just go in and park and then see how we feel and then we we're like let's just go in and then if we want to leave we can and we ended up staying it was a it was a good night it was all right afterwards we went and did tesco shop as much as we can because tesco was shutting in like 20 minutes when we got there so jack has popped out to morrison's now to go get the rest of the stuff that we wanted for baking and things like that i've been editing all morning i finished off the cotswolds vlog i've started the drive with me but I need to start cleaning now. I've put, I've had some washing on this morning, so I need to go sort that out first. I might go round and spray disinfectant everywhere, then let that sit. Put the washing on the drying thing, rack, whatever, then go and clean off all the surfaces. I feel like that's a plan. Yeah, that's the plan. Right, let's go do that.
coming at you to explain what happened with this video. So basically, I can't find any of my camera batteries anywhere. I have no idea where I've left them. I have just been finishing editing the driving with me video and I think I had more in the car on the drive home so I'm hopeful that they're somewhere because we were like we must have just left them in the hotel but when I've been editing that back it seems like <laughs> They were in the car, we just can't find them. So that made filming this very, very difficult because time lapses are the thing that eats up memory and battery the most. So once the battery died, I was like, okay, I'll find another battery. And then I just couldn't find one. And obviously I can't rapid charge this battery. So I just couldn't film any more content. So I'm sorry about that, but the house is clean and I didn't get to show you us cleaning a lot of it. So I'm sorry that this probably hasn't been the most satisfying clean with me but I'm gonna show you how we are looking everywhere. Kitchen is looking awesome. We have started setting up, we set this up last night just so we could keep stuff out that we knew we wanted out. We've shoved the dresser that's normally in the middle to the side with bins and stuff and we thought we could put drinks and stuff there. Again, if you are new, this is gonna be a DIY project for me in the new year. I just didn't have time to do it before Christmas like I wanted. The benches are all clean, it's looking awesome. All through here has been cleaned. I've cleaned all the walls because I think I got some of that in the footage but like Oakley just like splashes mud everywhere and then he also had like nose marks all up and down here because he opens the door and his nose leaves marks. Living room is looking great. Jack hoovered everywhere this morning like the he wanted to hoover the settees behind the like cushions, poof the cushions. So yeah everything's looking awesome and then obviously you saw me clean the bathroom and that is done and all through here as well. So yeah clean house. Obviously we mainly did it for today, which is our friends coming over, but it's really nice that it's also done for Christmas as well. Like we have a clean house for Christmas, which is just delightful. Really, really pleased about it. And Jack does get very like into his cleaning. So everything is clean, which is just lovely. So anyway, that is gonna be it for this video. I'm, like I say, I'm sorry it went so off the rails. We are near on the end of Vlogmas which is scary because I still have a few video gaps, but we're gonna figure it out. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to leave it a like, comment, subscribe, share, anything you're willing to do, I would be grateful for. But even if you don't do any of those things, thank you for making it to the end, but I shall hopefully see you in another video.